seventeenth time, I think. So, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. What's it's, the uh, it's been a long time. Yes, yeah, so I'm. I'm super happy to be back in Bruges, and uh, yeah, it's it's always been a nice feeling. The you know Flanders. It's always been my favorite race when I was a kid, and I always try to enjoy as much as possible. And yeah, just participating in this kind of race. It's, it should be a special mo moment for every rider. And how do you feel? How is the shape? How has it been these last days? Well, it could be better, but I think I'm uh, I'm quite good. I'm getting better every every week, I think, and uh, hopefully I'm ready for Flanders. I just wanted to uh, to do a good race, at least to come in the final and see where I can uh, where I can uh, come out. Just give my best and see what I still have in the legs. Well, if you go in the final, can you follow Van Aert, Pogacar, and uh, Van Der Poel? <laughs> that would be hard. I think I think nobody can say yes on this uh, on this question. But uh, there is also a race behind those those guys, so hopefully I can I can be in the, the group behind. And just one last thing, as you spoke of the group behind, there is headwind in the final. Even if they go ahead, could they be caught at the end? Yeah, the, the, also the last years you saw like uh, there's not such a big gap. Also last year I saw yesterday I was like on 35 seconds from uh, from the first guys. So the gaps are not too big. So I think uh, there is always a chance with the headwind. Okay, Greg. Best of luck, success. Oh,